Hi, I'm, my name is Sherry Suyu. I am an associate professor at the Technical University of Munich and a Max Planck Fellow at the Max Planck Institute for Astrophysics. My research area involves using gravitational lensing, the bending of light by gravity, to study cosmology, galaxy formation evolution, and also stellar physics. In particular, we're using the bending of light by gravity uh, to look at lensed quasars. So these are quasars that are very far away and being strongly lensed by a foreground galaxy. And we're using these lens quasars to measure how fast our universe is expanding. And in the upcoming future, we are planning to use also lens supernova, where supernova are explosions of stars, to also use this strong lensing effect of supernova to both study cosmology, measuring the expansion rate of the universe, and also to use these supernova to study how the supernova explodes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so for young researchers, um, I think to get started in research, I think it's important to find the topics that you're interested in and that you're passionate about, and also to develop the passion. Um, and in this way, this is where you will actually enjoy the work you're doing. Because I think in, in research, it's fascinating in that we're really pushing the frontiers. We're trying to explore areas that people have not done before. It's really new. But sometimes, because it's unknown, it's uncertain, there is no answer yet, it can be quite frustrating to try to, you know, try, you know, path A doesn't work, path B. And it does require patience. Um, but if you're passionate about it, you will want to really try the different ways to you know, find the solution and discover um, the, the answer. So I think that's the, the main part is really finding something that you're interested in, that you're good at, and that you can develop your passion in. So in order to find a topic that you could be interested in, it's helpful to talk to researchers in the different areas and to learn what people are working on. And also, nowadays, a lot of the papers are available on the archive, um, so this is open access to everyone. One can read the papers, but there's many papers on the archive, so um, for example, you know, reading the, the highlights of um, top journals to see what is the latest uh, discoveries and research. So I think a lot of it is gathering information and trying to see the areas that you're interested in. Also at uh, local universities or nearby universities, there could be seminars and colloquia. It's also good to go to these as a way to really learn what are the new areas and topics of research. And by gathering these information and know what's out there, you can see which ones spark your interest the most and that are most fascinating for you to learn more. Um, so I, I would recommend sort of exploring and not be shy and talk to people and, and learn what's out there.